Hello everyone and this is my Eid makeup for 2021 so we are starting off with um, a bit of a cocktail so this is a combination of two primers and two foundations um, we have the e.l.f. Pro hydrating primer then we have the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk hydrating primer then I have added the Charlotte Tilbury Light Wonder in the colour Full Fair and then the Huda Beauty Faux Filter Foundation in the colour Macaroon. Um, I've just mixed that onto my palm and adding that onto my face um, as you do, like normal foundation. Um, and then next I am going to blend all of that with the Fenty Beauty um, found full bodied foundation brush. This is my absolute fave these days. Um, you know, I'm a convert. I'm an absolute convert now um, with brushes. Next, I'm going in uh, with correcting my dark circles. <clears throat> so I'm just using the Benefit Boing in number two. This is a brightening concealer. I use it as a corrector because it has um, like peachy undertones. Next, going in with my concealer. This is the Pat McGrath concealer in the color. Um, I think this is the color ten. Um, I'll I will double check and add it here for you. Um, so just adding that to the under eyes and my the, like the middle of my face, middle of my face, center of my face, and just using the same brush um, that I did for my foundation to blend everything in. Next going in with my eye primer, this is the Urban Decay Primer Potion, this is the original one, um, yeah no changes there. Then I'm setting my under eyes and my eyelids with this um, Charlotte Tilbury Flawless, um, Air, Flawless Airbrush Powder um, in the colour 2 Medium. Next, I'm going in with some contour. This is the contour stick from Fenty Beauty. This is the match sticks, and I'm using the color Amber 01. I almost think this is too light for me. Um, I bought it online, to be honest. I didn't check it, so I am not sure. But anywho, we shall persevere and um, see how it goes, basically. Now I'm just blending all of that in with a stippling brush. This is from Clinique, uh, also one of my favourites. Now I'm setting everything else um, with the same Charlotte Tilbury powder. Before this, I just um, set my under eyes and my like the centre of my face. Next, I'm going in with my Chanel bronzer again using the same stippling brush from Clinique. This is an absolute dream for such textures and also I have, although I have powdered my face, um, this brush actually really helps adding a uh, product on to powder, um, even if you're using like cream on powder, I know that's an actual sin, but oh well, you know, let's be a bit naughty, why not? Next I'm going in with some extra bronzer, this is my very crippled and literally butchered bronzer from um, Benefits is a Hula bronzer I'm just adding that on um, top of where I added the Chanel one. Next I'm going in with my liquid blush. Uh, this is the Cloud Paint from um, Glossier and it is called Puff. It's a very very nice um, natural glowy pink colour. For some reason it's not coming as vibrant on camera but in real life it's actually right up pink um, and it's extremely extremely um, pigmented so but it looks really nice anyway on the tops of my cheeks and a bit on my nose and then I'm going in with highlighter this is the highlighter from Pat McGrath this is the duo highlighter which has like a balm on one side and a gold highlighter on the other side um, this is not a kabam kind of highlighter, so I am adding a um, powder one. So this is my Dior highlighter, um, the Nude Luminizer in the color 01. Just adding that on the top there. And then I'm also adding this on my nose and um, on my cupid's bow as well. Why not? Let's shine through. Thank you. 
Now we're talking eyes. Uh, I am using the Tartist um, to go palette. This is like the travel one, but it's one of my favorites. The first color I'm using is called Drive, which is their um, lightest brown color. It's like a skin skin type color. Next, I'm using Crisp, which is a slightly like a terracotta um, burnt orange, orange yet brown color on top of that but that's just um, not all the way into the um, inside corners it's just like a third of the eye and then I'm just darkening my um, crease um, with the color Stylin which is the darkest brown in the palette And then finishing everything off with some pizzazz and that is the glitter which is called a hype I absolutely love this palette it's, it's just amazing even for travel it has everything that you need um, now I am curling my eyelashes these are the tweezer and eyelashes in case you are wondering um, and now, please don't judge me. I know this is an absolute cringe moment, but I've, I've I don't use eyeliner, but I am. Um, this is the Maybelline eyeliner, which is a very old one and a really good one. Um, this is actually one of my favorites these days. It's the gel eyeliner from Maybelline um, from back in the day. Um, right, going on to eyebrows, I am using my trusty L'Oreal um, eyebrow plumper in the color. I want to say dark brown. Um, I think they have a dark brown now so this is like the medium one I think they do have a black one as well so but I just use this and I do um, two coats um, on each eyebrow next going in with my mascara this is the 202 mascara um, I did a whole review of this this is the one that I got from Instagram so check this out um, check the video out if you would like uh, for a full full review of this mascara so just adding that on to my top and bottom lashes um, next I am going in with um, some eye pencil this is the Rimmel Ex Exaggerate um, brown pencil it's a waterproof one so I'm just literally just adding that ever so lightly in my waterline now um, onto the lips now I have three lip options for you so I'm just lining my lips with um, the NYX lip pencil in, um, in the color I want to say chocolate truffle or caramel truffle it's like a really cool toned brown now the first option that we have is one from Tom Ford so I've got like a pinky option for you um, a dark brown and then a red so this is like the pinky nudie one um, this is Indian Rose from Tom Ford the next one is Charlotte Tilbury one um, and this is called this one's called Mrs Kisses so this is like a dark brown one um, and the final one is this one from Fenty Beauty um, so this is their lip paint in uh, the color unmatched um, and yeah these are the three versions available for you i hope you guys have an amazing amazing eat and i'll see you guys next time thank you bye